welcome back to our channel. Today's video, as you can see, is a cleaning motivation video. This is my first time doing a cleaning motivation video, so be sure to like this if you are enjoying this kind of content so that I can make more videos like this. We are starting in my master bedroom. I am making the bed. It takes me a few minutes to get this going because I'm back and forth, back and forth, but we recently redid our master bedroom actually last summer and now it is just the way I like it and so it always feels nice to make the bed in the morning. Alright, bed's all made and I moved on to vacuuming up the floors. This was just a simple quick vacuum. I have already vacuumed recently so it didn't really need that much work. After vacuuming in the bedroom, I just moved straight into our bathroom and I got started right away wiping down all of the counters. I had to move the stuff out of the way but just did section by section. I don't know about you guys but bathrooms are my least favorite chore so I try to just get it done and not think about it too much so that I can just be done with it. Today I pretty much just worked on the counters and the sinks and the mirrors, but I did not get to do the shower that day. So maybe next time. supplies almost in every area of my house that way I don't have to go upstairs or downstairs and lug around different cleaning materials so I keep certain things in my bathroom so that it's easy and accessible and ready to clean Like I said, I don't really enjoy cleaning bathrooms, so I start there first. Um, recently in this bathroom though, we just ordered a new toilet seat, and you'll see later, but it unsnaps and comes completely off so easy, which makes it really easy for cleaning. I love it. It makes me feel so much better about making sure that it's nice and clean. And in the bathroom this time, I am using Clorox wipes because coronavirus, I'm just trying to get all the germs out of there. This is the bathroom that everybody uses if they come over, so I just wanted to make sure it was nice and sanitary. Alright, so I had to take a little break from downstairs and come upstairs so that I could get started folding some of this laundry since some of the piles were really building up. I got one last load out of the dryer and just went to town. Normally every kid has their own laundry basket and everything is separated so that it's easy for me to sort through but like I said I let laundry get a little out of hand this time so I'm going through each of the clothes and trying to figure out which kid it belongs to. Some of their things are similar in sizes so you'll see me checking the tags to see who it might belong to. The girls come in later and get their own clothes because we have them put their own clothes away and they start switching things around because I got something wrong here or there.
only do I have trouble sorting through their clothes, but since they're so close in age, I also have trouble sorting through their undies, so I had them all come in and tell me whose are whose because I had no idea. Ah, oh, laundry is all done, and we went back downstairs. Here I am just picking up the living room. I needed to vacuum our couch and just get rid of some of the little crumbs on the floor from movie night. There was some popcorn under there, who knows what else. One day I should probably move the whole couch because I'm sure there's lots of fun stuff under there. But the living room is pretty easy to clean up. Next up, I moved on to our dining room area. Behind the dining room table, we have a two-part desk, so I just tidied up that area and then started to wipe down our table. From lunch, there were crumbs, and then some of the chairs were a little dirty, so they needed some refreshing cleaning going on there because kids, but that's why I have these type of chairs. They are so easy to clean. They're from Target, and they're metal, so kids can't ruin them. And now I am tackling the playroom. It wasn't too messy, and usually the girls are in charge of cleaning up after themselves in this area, but sometimes it's just easier to not ask them to do it and just get it done, get it over with, and that's what I chose to do today. Does anybody else uh, vacuum around their dog so they don't have to make them get up? <laughs> Probably just me, but how could I disturb him? just like I don't enjoy cleaning the bathroom so I put that first I actually enjoy cleaning the kitchen so I put that last and I like to look at a clean kitchen um, this drawer down here that I just opened it has all of our kids stuff so our easy access I did that a couple years ago and it is amazing they don't have to ask me for cups for water and it's perfect uh, I don't know if you can see back there but my girls are already destroying the playroom so they had to clean it up a second time but now I'm just loading the dishwasher and then I am going to have to hand wash a couple dishes and let them dry. kitchen is all done and now last on our list is to finish up this project we did a board and batten wall with gray paint on this really really tall wall and then we also did a board and batten wall on this wall of our staircase with bright white pink which meant that the risers did not look as bright as the wall so we decided that we needed to repaint them and I am so happy that we did through and got the easy job of rolling the paint on and I came behind him with a paintbrush to get closer to the edges and the bottom of the step and the top of the step even though I taped it off I still got paint on the stairs but they have polyurethane on them so it was easy to clean up afterwards do 
two coats, which took a lot longer than I thought it was going to take, seeing as the risers already had two or three coats from last summer. So I really hope this isn't a yearly update that we will need to do. and everything is shiny and clean and fresh. I seriously love this part. Even if it only lasts for five minutes because my kids know how to make a mess and fast, which I'm sure you can relate to. Anyways, like I said in the beginning, this was my first cleaning video that I did. So if you like videos like this and enjoyed our video, please be sure to give us a big thumbs up. Consider subscribing and click that notification bell so that you know when we have more videos. Bye.